that's a hind. You've got to take it out somehow. Either neutralize the soldiers or bring down the chopper. Good luck. Tää pasifistilla tavalla tätä vetää läpi nyt sitten. Niin on helikopteria vastaan taistu. Kuitenkaan hirveän pahoin tappio. Boss, I'm starting to wonder if recruiting the soldiers with the Fulton isn't a little. As a new master, I already don't like where this is going. I think the voluntary approach could be more pragmatic. Technically, we're not a corporate entity. But at our size, that's not too far from the truth. Mm. We can't keep using guerrilla tactics to find new blood. To search for volunteers, select recruit from the menu. Uh -huh. Or select trade to exchange soldiers with other mercenary units. Yeah, provided we got the friends for that. Katsotaan, minkälaiset pääsyvaatimukset on sotilaat ilman rajoja yhdistykseen. Looks like our reputation is spreading. We've got battle-hardened veterans from all kinds of places trying to join our army. But they insist on testing your skills to see if you're the real deal before they'll join. Let's put these arrogant upstarts in their place. Take them down using hand-to-hand strikes or CQC. If you can knock them all out within the time limit, they'll join us, becoming powerful allies. Don't disappoint them, boss. 
Show them what you got. Jo tässä pelissä sillä kesti joutuu grindaamaan, niin toistamaan samoja tehtäviä, että saa värvättyä itselleen tyyppejä. Tai hankittua sitä kalustoa. No, hyvä. Eikö tää ranta ollut Kolumbiassa? Nyt tätäkin tehtävää voisi toistaa ja toistaa, mutta tässä taitaa olla muita, muita tehtäviä tällaisia. Näin. Snake vastaan kymmenen jätkää. Snake, Juu. infiltrate Dr. Strangelove's research lab and either deactivate or destroy the AI. Äläkä unohda the korttia. The built into some ancient ruins, so find those first. All right. Ei ole sanottavaa. Joo, siellä on näitä sissejä. This area is a tropical cloud forest. Mm -hmm. Continually covered in a thick mist. Kiva. It is quite a mystical place. Salva de la leche. Forest of milk. I can barely see in front of me. There you go again. The forest is basically sitting in a cloud. So of course it's going to be hard to see. But you know, the cloud forest is the only place many exotic creatures can live. Well, if they're not edible, <laughs> I'm not interested. Snake. I'll have you know people travel from all around the world to witness Costa Rica's unique fauna. Catarata de la Muerte means waterfall of death. Keep up. Huh. How cheerful. You. I am sure it will be no problem for you, Day. Snake. Especially compared to all the dire situations you've faced in the past. Yeah, easy to say now. We'll see what really happens. Sorry. Still, you have surprised me. Everything they say about the legend is true. I'm neither hero nor legend. But for some reason, I don't mind you calling me that. Thanks. Be careful, Snake. Peace. Peace. <laughs> Selva de la Muerte, huh? Forest of Death. Hmm. Wouldn't want to get lost here. Sure wouldn't. But do not worry. I will be your guide. Happy to hear it. By the way, Snake, you know much about sloths? Hmm? Just the name. They are amazing. Sloths spend almost all of their lives up in the trees. Flies here, yeah. Except for when they have to go to the bathroom. Plus, they barely eat a thing. What? How do they survive? Why do you think they are called sloths? They hardly move. So they hardly burn any energy. They are also able to maintain a low body temperature, lowering their metabolism further and allowing them to survive on very little. Wouldn't that make it easier for them to get picked off by predators? They stick to the trees, helping them blend in and stay out of sight. They say there are even some sloths that grow moss when they reach a certain age, like some sort of fairy tale forest hermit, huh? Hmm. I knew a great old sniper once. Neil. I guess he was even more in tune with nature than I thought. Old sniper? What are you talking about? La ruinas de Xochiquetza will be around there. They have not been restored at all, so they may well be covered in plants. Xochiquetza? An Aztec goddess of fertility and mm. beauty. They say she was always accompanied by birds and butterflies. One theory states she was the mother of the god known as Quetzalcoatl. Quetzalcoatl. The Quetzal is said to be an incarnation of Quetzalcoatl, hence its name. I get it. Well, hmm. this place definitely matches the atmosphere of a cloud forest. Now, it may have seen better days, but that is still a hmm. temple. So be sure to show respect when you're inside. If the mood strikes me. <sighs> well. You've got no one to blame but yourself. If Shochi Quetzal strikes you down.
The paths there are buried in vegetation. Work with nature to conceal yourself, and you'll be much harder to spot. Uh, a ghillie suit would be perfect here. Mm. In any case, take caution when advancing. Don't wear anything that stands out. The ruins are a labyrinth, so try and keep your bearings. Uh, I could use those walls to stay out of sight. Once a sniper is spotted, he'll move to another location. Mm. You shouldn't stick to the same place either. Oh, I know. I learned all about that in the Soviet Union. Yeah. It is not necessarily a good idea to try to engage a sniper in close quarters combat. Mm, so Finally, once you've found a place to hide, don't let them take you from behind. Don't worry. No one sneaks up on me. So this Dr. Strangelove was at NASA? Yeah. Well, actually, Strangelove left for DARPA not long after I joined. And then the two of you ended up back together doing research at Costa Rica. Not exactly together. We coordinated on a few things, but the research projects themselves hmm. were separate from each other. We had it worked out so that Dr. Strangelove handled the mammal pod, Peace Walker's cerebrum, while I did the rest. That letter... something to do with your research? Huh? Uh, well, no, it's a... Uh, yeah, it's a report. Research findings. Research findings? Anything in there we could use against Peace Walker? Mm. N nothing. Nothing at all. Just don't read it, okay? Promise me you won't? Inkilökohtaisia asioita. Sitten vaan menoks. Scouts are really hard to spot because they use grass or dirt to camouflage themselves. They blend right in with the natural surroundings. Recovery subject confirmed on board helicopter. Fulton recovery helicopter is complete. I need to go to our camp, we have here. Vähän tummempi vihreä kuin ympäristö. Tämä nyt meni vähän paremmin kuin äsken yritys. Oh, 
pistää joku kirppa. Hei! Tu m'a trouvé! C'est moi le loup! rien pour Rasko. French. Fini de jouer à cache-cache. Je n'ai pas besoin de jouer. Please, do not kill me! You know, soldier. I am a tourist. What's your name? Please. What are you doing here? Cecile. Cosima. Come in now. You're not one of the soldiers? Mm, Please. No, your gun. Who are you? I'm. An ornithologist. <laughs> a poacher? The gun's for self-defense. I'm looking for uh, that one rare bird in Costa Rica. Which one? The Quetzal? Right, the Quetzal. Hmm. <laughs> they're rare, but they're not covered under the Washington Treaty. The resplendent Quetzal is red listed. Really? You know your stuff. <laughs> I am an ornithologist myself. Ah, uh, well, we'll have to compare notes Niin to pongereita viidä, kun saa seiden kanssa. Drink some of this. You saved me. They told me this was a paradise. That there were more rare birds here than anywhere else. That there was no war here. That it was safe. They told me it was every birder's dream, but they were wrong. Hmm. What happened? If only I had not recorded that stupid voice. Voice? Oh. I was trying to capture the kettle song. Making my way through a thicket, I saw immense ruins before me. I chase it away. It will bite you unless you kill it. You are the one who made the tape. Hmm. I am loyal to myself. Who's there? Who's there? I was captured by that woman. But she was kind. She gave me food to eat and even bathed me herself each day. But she said I could go home in a month. So whatever you do. Don't take off the blindfold. Do so, and you will never leave here. Hmm. Hmm. Guess you didn't listen. How'd you escape? I waited for an opening. Stole an ID card. They almost caught me. But I managed to elude them. You made it this far, and then succumbed to exhaustion. I was barefoot. With no supplies. I'm so sorry. I drink it all. That facility. Did you see anybody else in there? Well, there was another woman, but I never saw her in person. Hmm. Because you know, the blindfold. Oh yes, she often sang. Sang. It was such a strange song. What kind of person was she? Could you tell anything from her voice? I don't know. I don't even know why I was held a prisoner. They confiscated my equipment, my supplies, my passport, money, everything. The only thing I was allowed to keep were my undergarments. So that I would not be able to escape. And now, I am without even the means to prove who I am. I will not make it home to Paris like this. In that case, hmm. come to our place. Huh? You don't need a passport there. Don't even need a name. If you want to go back to Paris, we'll take you there anytime. What I want is a shower, a change of clothes, and a cigarette. I've got a cigar. It's Cuban. Hmm. Not French cigarettes? They prefer unfiltered. Fresh out. But come back to my place. You can have all the French cigarettes you want. It sounds like heaven. <laughs> Close, but not quite. 
outer heaven. It is something better all the time. Mm -hmm. So, you must have gotten a look at the facility when you escaped, right? What's in there? A lot of machinery. A big computer, like you would see in the university. What about the room where you heard the voice? Anybody in there? I don't know. There was a tube. A large tube in the back. Hmm. When I approached it, I heard a voice. What did it say? Jack. Yes, it simply said Jack over and over. <gasps> Jack. Listen, you've got to get me out of here. I really need a shower. Wait here. I've still got business to take care of. What? You're not thinking of going in there, are you? You can't leave me here. Relax. I'll have some friends pick you up. This is Miller. One for recovery. A civilian. Snake, we don't have room for any more civilians here. Hmm. Not even for a blonde <laughs> crazy hen. A what? <laughs> so she's, uh, pretty foxy? Uh, see for yourself. If what she's saying is true, I think we've found Paz's friend. The missing one? I'm thinking that she's the one that made that tape. Have her listen to it when she gets there. So she's safe then. Good news. I'm sure Paz will be glad to hear it. You bet. Snake, the ruins are just up ahead. Head north. On my way. What about me? Stay put. Ever wonder what it's like to be a bird? <laughs> huh? Joo, mun toi vähän raaka tapa evakuoida tyyppejä metsästä. Komea pytinki. Mikä vartija on etuovelta? Haa. Rakenteellista suojausta. No, one has pistol some court in the other. It won't open. Damn. It won't open. What's wrong with it? What a tenet court. Snake? Huey, your ID card isn't working. It won't open the lock. <sighs> it can't be. No, What's you? going on? She hates me that much? <laughs> Strange loves in charge of authorizing IDs. Sometimes a working card has its privileges removed. Say, if she decides she doesn't like that card's carrier. Mm. You think that's what happened? Well, I was never exactly her favorite. Oh. Well, this could be tricky. The soldiers outside aren't allowed in the lab either, so their cards won't do you any good. Mm. Great. Snake. Kaz, where's Cecile? She just got here. Hold on. Snake! Cecile, how'd it feel to fly? <laughs> Wonderful. For a moment, I felt what it must be like to be a bird. It almost made me want to give up my research and get a pilot's license. Did you need something? You said you'd gotten an ID card, right? Yes, but it was confiscated when the guards got me. Uh -huh. Who took it? What did he look like? He had an orange jacket. <sighs> I cannot recall his face, though. Yeah, they all look pretty much the same. Hmm. Where did it happen? Hmm. Let me think. Ah, yes! I do remember hearing the song of a nearby cat <laughs> Just what I'd expect from a birder. Would you like to hear it? Huh? What's that song? It's my cat -cell. I took it with me when I was rescued. Didn't you say something about them being covered under the Washington Convention? <laughs> just kidding. That was just me. An imitation. An essential skill for any ornithologist. Pretty good, no? Damn good. If you want to hear the Kettle song again, just let me know. I can tell you all about the birth of Costa Rica, too. Yeah, will do. Thanks, Cecile. No, no. Thank you, Snake. Talk to you soon. The Cortez and Lindo Loud will have you that tape for Cecile. I sure did. It's hers, all right. Then she must be. She's not. Cecile said she's never even met Paz. What? She's at least ten years too old. But... 
I'm guessing Paz convinced herself that it was the tape her friend made. Yeah, but never mind that. Let's go over what we know so far. The soldier with the ID card is wearing an orange jacket and is in a location where you'll hear Quetzal singing. Find that soldier, retrieve that card. Tämä meni vähän monimutkaiseksi nämä operaatiot aina välillä.